I'm going to hope that we don't end up calling another attorney. To I don't, Judge, I, I didn't want to call the first one. I didn't really go that well for you, ultimately. I don't I, know. Well, let's see. <laughs> we'll see. Did she say, we'll see? I'm not a lawyer. Y'all know that. It's still day 128 and the judge and the attorneys are back. The jurors have gone home for the day. And I want to show y'all this second clip of Judge Whitaker. Attorney Love has brought back up the factual acknowledgement number eight on Antonio Sledge's plea deal because she's basically trying to get it in a piece of when her and Derek Wright were going back and forth about what would be included in the final plea deal to show that number eight wasn't really a surprise and she didn't really sneak it in. So she's trying to make that argument to the judge. I didn't feel it was something to go back and forth with the witness on the stand about. He testified, his memory was, he didn't remember seeing it. Right. But number eight, the personal knowledge part is a specific thing that wasn't denied, but that was implied. And, and I'm just saying that when um, Mr. Wright says he doesn't remember, that's fine. Mm -hmm. But when we provided to him the, the document that had it pulled out. There was not, I don't know how he says he didn't see it, but there was not any indication from anyone that that was incorrect. That wasn't just taken out of the air. That no, was. I, I know that it wasn't, but we have already talked about that. I know what the state I know and understand how it is that the state got to and believed that given the comments he made, you all could say, well, okay, still he, whether he knew it was planned or not, he still knew it happened and that they were responsible. But it doesn't actually say that in the iteration that got changed. But I do think that there is an attempt to um, convince the jury that essentially these are made up things that the that state you just put. slipped it in. Yes. Well, I, I, I mean, Ms. Love, then put somebody else on the stand. But I, I mean, you telling me this, this no, I mean, it doesn't do the, any, I mean. The reason that I was telling the court that was no. not to try and completely relitigate an issue, but as to the section that dealt with his response, not the whole response, not that it's mm -hmm. 460, but I would ask if the court um, might consider reconsidering just us putting in that one part that he responded to the way that he responded and then the ultimate okay. um version so that at least before the jury is where that came from since there has been this continued effort to convince them that we make stuff up and we just you know just out of thin air you're the one that decided to put him on the stand i, I don't regret that or i, I don't I don't think that that's a, the problem that maybe, you know, obviously m minds can disagree. I don't think that that's the problem. Okay. But. Well, if it were as clear as somewhere in the earlier version was the statement, I personally know that members of YSL were responsible for this murder or whatever it said in the ultimate version. If that were in the prior version, that would be one thing, but that's not in the prior version. So I'm not, I mean, I have thought that issue through. And yes, sir. If I, I understood that to be your argument yesterday or okay. the day before or whenever it occurred, the day before and yesterday. And I just. Yes, Your Honor. Okay. Oh! Appreciate you giving it yet another. <laughs> and I'm being facetious when I'm here. I know you are. Okay. Ciao. Before the day ends, the judge says, depending on what the update is regarding that juror issue, we'll determine if jurors and witnesses are brought back tomorrow or if it's another day for just the judge and the attorneys. All right. And do we have any word? Okay. All right. So we will reconvene at nine tomorrow and hopefully we'll be able to do jury and witnesses. And apparently we haven't heard anything yet. Okay. She So just plan to do that and if not it'll be another day like this yes your honor okay thank you all